guys and welcome this is Xbox One Battlefield 4 gameplay my name is Witted Fish today I'm gonna go ahead and talk to you guys about being a casual gamer and getting the most points out of your gameplay the way that I would start off is just by playing objective based games so usually I play Conquest Large you get a ton of points just from capturing like objectives you also get a ton of points in obliteration and in rush where you're arming MCOMs and arming bombs. Make sure that you're playing these kinds of maps because you get the most points out of them. If you're playing just straight team deathmatch, you'll level up your weapons quickly, but you won't level up as quickly as everyone else who's playing the objective based games. So. I'm going to go ahead and talk from the perspective of being an assault class because I really like being a medic because I'm a medic in real life. Uh, it, it's a lot of fun to me. You can get a lot of points just from healing people. Now you get even more points if you're healing your squad mates. And Using squad-based uh, movement and capturing objectives together will get you a ton of points. If you're a squad leader, make sure you're telling your people what, which points to attack and what you want them to do. This will grab you an additional couple of points. If you're spotting or if you like to spot, make sure that you're doing that because you'll get 25 points if that person gets killed that you just spotted. 50 if your squad mates kill him. So these are important things to think about. They're going to grab you the most points and level you up even faster. Now, if you're defibrillating people, if you're defibrillating your squad mates, you'll get more points for that. So these are important things to think about. Now the other thing is, is that people don't realize the longer you stay alive, the more points you're going to end up getting out of it. So try to play based off of your strengths. Are you a close or are you a ranged player? So the assault class has two really, really good weapons in my opinion. Uh, the SAR-21 and the AEK-971. Now, uh, people like other weapons like the M416 and all that jazz. No, that's cool. You guys pick whatever weapon that you want to use. But these are the two that I'm going to pick out based on just gameplay styles. So, if you're a close player, then you're probably going to want to go ahead and use the AEK-971. This weapon has a 900 rounds per minute. It spits out a ton of ammunition and will kill people pretty dang quickly. Now, the SAR-21 is more based for, like, long range. So, you want to stick to the back. Um and try and take people out from range. You don't want to necessarily run in with a 650 round per minute weapon because you're going to get plowed by people who have PDWs or, you know, some kind of weapon that spits out more rounds than you are. You're not going to win that gunfight. So the other thing important to think about is, do you have a suppressor on your weapon? Can you get in there and make a difference? So make sure that if you do have a suppressor on your weapon, you're trying to flank around them. See if you can talk to your squad mates on the VoIP and send them in and then flank around the other side. You know, that way you're going to get more kills out of it and you're not going to be seen on the minimap. Now, if you're a range player, then make sure that you're sticking to range kind of weapons. You know, don't pick out a PDW and then try to snipe people with it. It's just not going to work. You're not going to get that many points for it. So, keep on trying to kill people and everything but do it the smart way try and get in on points but stick to the outside and then work your way in like it it's not that difficult to up you know to level up in this game it does take a while it's not like cod no offense to cod players that's cool but i hope that you guys are enjoying this i hope that you enjoyed this video if you would like to see more or hear about anything or see his particular weapon please let me know please like and subscribe i'm really loving doing this i hope you guys are enjoying the videos you guys take care and i'll talk to you later